Bill, Mickey, got Terry joining on too. All right. So we're going to start off. Um, so for today, last week we were doing a lot of AM reps. Today, we're going to do more of like pyramids and stuff like that. All right. So the rep range is going to be anywhere between 10 and 25. All right. And we're going to start at the low end. So we're going to start with uh, from 10 and work our way up from 10, 15, 20, 25, and work our way back down. All right. I'm going to show you each exercise um, as they come. So I want to show you the whole list. So we're going to start with dead bugs. It's going to be 10 reps. Remember, dead bugs on our backs. It's going to be five each arm. So just arsenic, opposite arm and leg. All right. After that, if you're done a little early, what we're going to do is hold up and do a hollow hold. All right. So between each exercise, we're going to have a placeholder. All right. So we're going to do a hollow hold for dead bugs. But each, after each exercise, it might change. So I'll let you know. All right, so we start with dead bugs. We got 10 reps, five each side. Once you're done with those, just hold a hollow hold until I give you the next exercise. And we go keep moving, all right? Y'all ready? 10 dead bugs, and go. Make sure you keep that lower back in contact with the ground, trying to get that core stabilized. Stabilize the muscles warmed up. All right, remember when you're done, hold that hollow hold. I'm watching, so I'll let y'all know what to do next. Keep working, keep working. Once everyone's done, then we'll move on, all right? Here we go. Good work, good work, good work. I'm going to hold that hollow hold. I'm watching, I'm watching. Keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. All right, three, two. One, all right, all right, we're up, we're up. We're gonna stand up, go right into an inchworm. We got 15 inchworms. Walk it out, walk it back up. All right, you can add a push up if you want to. And go. All right, so once you're done with this inchworm, we're gonna do some high knees or you can run in place. All right, high knees or run in place. You're working hard with these inch worms, all right? Those shoulders warmed up. Get stressed for the hamstrings. Keep that core engaged. Remember, only 15, only 15. Then we got those high knees or run in place. Good work, good work, good work. Everyone's looking good. Keep it up, y'all. Keep it up, keep it up. Keep on working. There we go. There we go. Then once you're done, high knees or run in place. Just keep on moving. Trying to keep moving the entire time. All right. Good, 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 good. good nice. Swarm those shoulders up nice and good. All right, all right. Keep working. I'm gonna keep that core engaged. Good work, y'all. Good work, good work. No, the shoulder might be burning. We're gonna switch it up. We're gonna switch it up after this. We won't be doing anything with the shoulders. All right, so in the high knees, run in place. You can march. Just keep moving, keep moving. Remember, only 15 inch runs, only 15, all right? Once everyone's done, we're going to move on, all right? Good, good. Everybody's looking like they're about to die. Keep working, keep working, all right? Ten more seconds. We're going to switch it up. Working, keep working, keep working. Three, two, one. All right, stay running in place, stay running in place on high knees. We go head to the ground next, all right? So remember, we got windshield wipers. Remember, legs straight, side to side. You control fashion, keep that chest towards the ceiling, all right? Remember, you can keep legs straight or knees bent, all right? We're going to do 10 each side, 20 total, all right? 20 total. After that, we got a hollow hold, all right? Y'all ready? Windshield wipers and go. 
Number 10 each side, 20 total. We'll do a nice good hollow hold after that. Keep working. Working those obliques here, right? Remember your legs don't have to touch the ground. Just go as far as you can go from side to side. Nice control fashion. Really good for the hips and that core, those obliques, right? Keep on working. And after this, we got hollow hold. Hollow hold to everyone finish. If you finish early, all right. Good work, good work, good work. And we also, if you need to, you can bend those knees side to side. Rather than keep those legs straight, that still works. Still getting that work in. All right, all right, all right. Keep pushing, y'all. Keep pushing. Everybody's looking like they're almost there. They're almost there. Good work, good work, good work, good work. Nice, good hollow hold. Any variation works. Everybody look like they're about done. 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Three. Two, one. All right, you can release if you need to, or you can keep holding it. We got a star crunch. So we on the ground again. Star crunch out wide. Bring it all together in the middle. All right. So out wide. Bring it all together in the middle. Keep those shoulders off the ground as you crunch in. Keep working hard. We got 25. 25 star crunches. And go. So keep working hard, all right? I'll let you know in a couple seconds what we go do after the star crunch. Placeholder, all right? Make sure as you crunch up, keep those shawls off the ground. Oh, uh, Ellen did those too. Ah, uh, I'm sorry guys, who took Ellen's class. <laughs> Y'all got this though, y'all got this. All right, once you're done with this, got a plank hold, plank hold, all right? That's what we're gonna do between each exercise. Just keep working, keep working. Here we go, there we go. Everybody looking good, looking good. Keep it up, keep it up. Good work, y'all, good work. Way to push. Right, all right, remember we got the plank hold. Remember once you're done with these, the plank hold. Hold that plank. Remember only 25 star crunches, only 25, all right? Then hold that plank. Then you can, any variation works. Keep working, keep working, all right? Everybody look like they're about dying. 10 seconds, y'all, 10 seconds. Before we switch it up. Keep holding, keep holding. Three, two, one. All right, all right, we're gonna stay in the same position. We got up down planks. You will get a nice good shoulder burn here. Up down planks, all right, 10 each side, 20 total. Y'all ready? And go. Up, up, down, down. Let me alternate which side goes up each time. Give both sides equal work. Just keep working hard. Here we go, there we go. Create a push, y'all, way to push. Building those strong shoulders here and core. Maybe if you want to intensify the exercise, you can add a push up in between each up down plank if you want. If not, just keep working. 
You can also do it from your knees, all right? And we can drop down to your knees and try to up down plank, the same thing, all right? Good work, y'all, good work. Once you're done with this, I'm sorry, we're gonna hold another plank, we're gonna hold another plank. Then we're gonna switch it up, y'all, I promise, I promise. All right? Let's keep working. There we go, there we go. Way to push, y'all, way to push, way to push, way to push. Everybody's looking good, looking good, looking good. Keep working, keep working, all right? 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Everyone's about done. Got those up, down planks in. I promise you, I'll give you a break from the shoulders on the next one. Three, two, one. All right, all right. We can relax, flip it over. We got some ab circles, all right? So for this round, we're going to do 15. Do one side, all right? We're going to do it again, you're going to do the opposite side, all right? So remember which side you do. Remember, ab circles out, bring it in, bring it out, bring it in, all right? So do one side, 15. And then the next time we come back to it, you go do the opposite side, all right? Y'all ready? And go. And bring that, bring everything in together. We're going left to right. Really bring it in there. Remember that direction you're going in. Because you're going to do it again, all right? Go switch opposite sides. All right, after this, you got hollow hold, hollow hold. All right. And we got hollow hold, any variation. You get a little fatigued here. Maybe you can bring those knees in on that hollow hold, all right? Don't have to hold those legs out. If you really want to challenge yourself, you can. Keep working, keep working. All right, 10 seconds, y'all. Everybody looks about done. 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Three, two, one. All right, all right. We're going to flip it over again. Flip it over. Plank arm extensions, all right? So remember, extend that arm out. Five each side. 10 total, all right? Everyone ready? And go. Remember, once you're done with these, hold that plank. Just hold that plank. Keep it in that same position, all right? Good work, y'all. Good work, good work, good work. Keep on pushing. Got it, y'all. We got it. Remember, hold that plank. When you're done, all right? And you can do these on your knees. All right? Keep working hard. Five each side, 10 total, all right? All right, all right, all right. Everybody's almost done here. Looking good, looking good. 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Keep working, keep working, keep holding, keep holding. Couple seconds. Three, two, one. All right, all right, we can flip it over again. We're gonna do ab circles, the opposite side, all right? So do the opposite side you did last time, all right? We got 15, 15. And go. Come on, y'all, we almost done here. We almost done here. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Push through it, push through it. Really make sure to breathe, that helps. Control your breathing. And try to hold that breath, all right? It really helps with these exercises here. Once you're done with that, you got hollow hold, hollow hold, all right? Here we go, keep working, keep working. Everybody looks about done. 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Work, 
work. Hold it, hold it. Three, two, one. All right, all right. We can stand up now. We can stand up. We're going to try a lunge with a twist, all right? Lunge with a twist. Those, go lunge. You go twist to that forward leg and alternate, all right? So nice deep lunge, good twist, work those obliques. Make sure those knees go out, all right? We're gonna do 10 each side, 20 total, all right? 10 each side, 20 total, y'all ready? And go. Doing it. Keep working, keep working, y'all. Keep working. Let me try to get as deep as you can in that lunge. Good control twist. Right. Getting on those rotational muscles, rotational strength. Right. After this, you got high knees. High knees, marching or walking in place, all right? Or running in place. All right. So you just gonna stay up with the placeholder for this one. Keep working hard. There we go, there we go. Keep working, y'all, keep working. Remember, 20 total, 10 each side. We got those high knees marching in place. That's how I know you guys are done. Then we can move it up, move it on, move it on. There we go, keep working, keep working, keep working. Everybody's still pushing. Good work, good work. We got it, we got it. I got about a couple more reps. I see it. And after this, marching high knees. Good, good, good. All right, all right. Looking like everybody's almost done. Keep going, guys. I'll let you know what's next. I think everyone's just about done. Done. Perfect. All right, I'm back. I'm back. Minute. Okay. All right. And relax. 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 All right. We go ahead to the ground again. We got that toe crunch. All right. So remember, a couple options here. Keep those legs straight. You're going to reach up for those toes, bring those shoulders off the ground. All right. Another option. Those knees bent. Reach up. Or you can, if you want to, you can drop those knees to the ground and reach up as well, all right? Maybe you can grab a dumbbell. You can use those with these exercises if you have one near. We got 20, 25, sorry. We got 25, 25 toe crunches. Y'all ready? And go. Reach up down. Should bring those shoulders off the ground. If you feel a little like it's a little too much to keep those legs straight for the lower back, you can bend those knees or drop them to the ground. Just make sure you really pull that belly button towards your spine, engage that those stabilization muscles. All right. Use your, your core to control you going up and down. Try not to use momentum, all right. Good work, good work, good work. Remember 25, 25. We got it, y'all, we got it. Then we back to a hollow hold. For a couple seconds in between. Good work, good work, good work, all right. 10 seconds. Keep working, keep working. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Three, two, one. All right, all right. We're going to flip it over, flip it over. A couple more, y'all. We're almost done. Bear crawl toe taps or bear crawl knee taps, all right? So remember, bear crawl position. Hover those knees over the ground. Wrist underneath those shoulders. You're going to reach for that opposite toe or opposite knee, all right? So opposite foot or opposite knee, all right? We're going to try. 10 on each side, 20 total, all right? 10 on each side, 20 total. Y'all ready? And go. So really try to bring that knee towards that hand, all right? Or those toes towards that hand as you reach. 
Try to stay in that nice hover position, back flat, core engaged. You need to speed it up, slow it down. Make sure you have control throughout the entire exercise. Really engaging that core. There we go, there we go. You got a plank hold, plank hold, once you're done, plank hold. There we go, everybody breeze through that bad boy. You go, keep it up, keep it up, keep it up. You got 10 seconds, y'all, 10 seconds. Keep working, keep working, keep working. Couple seconds, three, two, one. All right, we can bring it back up, bring it back up. Of course, we got some 15 burpees, 15 burpees, y'all. I know, I know. We almost done. We almost done. I promise. Y'all ready? Fifteen burpees, and go. Maybe if you have a bed next to you or a couch, you can do incline. You know, jump it up and down on the uh on the couch or bed. A little less intensity there. All right. Remember, if you want to add some more intensity, add that push up in, like I see Terry doing. Mm -hmm. There we go, there we go. Keep working though, keep working. We got this y'all, we got this. Once you're done, we got a plank hold, plank hold. All right, only 15 burpees, then we got a plank hold. Good work, good work, good work, good work, good work. And to hold that plank, hold that plank. Everybody looks about done. 10 seconds, 10 seconds. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Couple seconds. Three, two, one. All right, all right, we're gonna flip it over, flip it over. Last one for this. We just got 10 bridges, all right? So we just gonna kind of open up there, back down, all right? So 10 bridges, or if you wanna do five single leg bridges, that works. Y'all ready? And go. All right, all right, once you're done with this, we got hollow hold. Right, all right, that's how we go end off. Hollow hold, hollow hold. Good work, good work. All right, we're gonna try to hold this for a little bit longer than what we usually do. All right, for about a minute. See what we got here. See what we got here. We can do hollow hold rock. Keep those shoulders off the ground. You can bend those knees in, add any, any variation you want. Just keep working, all right, all right. Remember, this is the last thing we gotta do for today. This is it. So really work here. Don't let that lower back lift off the ground. Try to keep it in contact. Or keep it straight, nice and engaged. Less than 30 seconds, y'all. Y'all got this, y'all got this, y'all got this. Come on, come on, come on. We almost there, we almost there. Keep holding, keep holding. Less than 15. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Couple seconds. Three. Two, one, and relax. There we go. Good work, y'all. Good work, good work. Way to push, all right. We're done, we're stretching, we're stretching. So stay on your back, stay on your back. Uh-oh. Stay on your backs here. Loosen up that back. We can bring both knees towards our chest. 
Make sure to inhale, exhale, nice and deep here. Try to bring that heart rate down. Good work, y'all. Way to push, way to push. Get a nice, good stretch here. We're gonna stand on our back. All right, whenever you're ready, you can release that right leg. All right, keep that left knee up towards your chest here. Hold it for a couple seconds. And then we go slowly twist it to the right side and open up to the left here. All right. Hold this for about 10 seconds here. Before we switch it up. All right, slowly bring it back to starting position. Bring both knees towards your chest again. You can rock side to side. All right, when you're ready, slowly release that left leg in front of you. Keep that right knee up towards your chest. Inhale deep, exhale. Inhale. On your exhale, you can slowly release that right knee to the left side and open up to the right. And we try to keep that chest towards the ceiling. Inhale, bring it back to the starting position. Right, both knees towards the chest. From here, we're gonna go right into a butterfly stretch, right? So drop those knees or those feet to the ground. Stretching out the adductors here. You stay on your backs. Nice gentle stretch here. All right, all right. You can bring those legs together and straighten them out in front of you. What we're gonna do is come up to an upright position, the right, just like this. You're gonna breathe in, hands over head, inhale, exhale, reach for our feet. Kind of relax those shoulders here. If you need to, you can kind of rock your head, yes. Nice and slow and gentle, or no. Slowly release those hands. Now we can spread open the legs. All right, we're gonna reach in between our legs first. In between, hold it for a couple seconds. Then we're gonna roll up, reach for our left leg here, left leg. And then reach for our right. And on the right, slowly release. We got a couple more stretches, then we're done. Go by the child's pose real quick. Stretch out those shoulders here. Kind of spread out the knees a little bit if you need to. Relax this forehead on the ground. We can slowly walk our hands out to the right side of our mats or bodies. And then slowly walk it back to the left side of our bodies. Slowly walk into the middle. You'll come up to a cobra, upward dog. And release. And then we'll end off stretching out the hip flexors and the chest. All done. All right. 
Lean forward, arms overhead if you need to. You add a side bend in if you want. Whichever stretch works the best for you here. Hold it, hold it, hold it. And then we go switch legs. Same thing. Hold this stretch, hold this stretch. And relax, relax, we can stand up. Just place our hands on our back or interlock our fingers. Really open that chest up, squeeze those shoulder blades. Look up towards the ceiling. Right, interlock our fingers, open up those shoulder blades, head down. And then end off reaching towards the sky. Down. One more time. And relax. Shake it all out. Roll the shoulders back. Roll that neck out. And we're done. Everybody good?